Good morning, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a short video because I want to do a uh, hand swatching and lip swatch of the new Chanel Rouge Coco Blooms. I got the chance of getting five of them and I want to thank Sean for sending me these so fast. I want to show you one by one what they look like. I'm going to do a hand swatching and also going to do a lip swatching. And I am in a different surrounding today because I'm inside my bathroom. They are a little bit different from the Coco Flash. You remember the Coco Flash had the, the gold trim and the top is still the same except that it has like the gold background and then it has a gold trim but it looks the same. Everything else is the same except it's gold. Now with the Coco Bloom it's a little bit different because they're not gold trimmed, they're silver trimmed. So here, here's what they look like. See the silver and then the top is still clear. You can see the color, but it's silver, it's not gold. And when you open it, the packaging is silver here as well. And silver inside the cap is not gold trimmed. So it's a little bit different. And the formula is also a bit different, I've heard, because I haven't tried them on my lips yet. But I've heard that they're more opaque than the Coco Flash ones. So let's start. This is the first one. Like I said, I got five. So this is the first one, number 110, in the shade Chance. It's a really pretty, like a brown nude. Let me swatch it on my hand. So this is Chance. Let me try now on my lips. Hmm, they feel very, very nice, very hydrating. And I feel like I have nothing on my lips, which I really like that. So I've heard that, that it is glowy at first, but then after a few minutes when it dries, that glowiness dissipates but it has a good staying power and good pigment. I am gonna end up using this color for the rest of the day. So I'll be able to see how long they, how long it lasts and how long does the glow stay and if it's really pigmented as they say. It says also in the description that it's plumping. So I do feel not a tingling sensation, but I do feel like, like freshness, for lack of another word, like very, very fresh. Like I have nothing on. Like I have a, like a lip balm on, but look at the pigment, that's not, a, the pigment of a lip balm and it's really really nice so that was chance okay the next shade i want to try is number 124 merve this is probably my favorite one in the swatching i've seen but let's see on me how it looks this is merve it's like a it's also like a brownish pink i thought it was gonna be redder but let's see Not redder, like more orange, coral. Hmm, it's very pretty. There's Merve. It's very pretty. It looked more, more coral than what I saw, and someone else is uh, swatching, but. I guess it's because of her lip shade. Now I'm going to go into an 130, 130 Blossom. This is really bright. That was really pretty. Oh, I like this one. It's really bright and fun and springy and summery. And I forgot to do the swatching on my hands first. So let me do Merveille and then Blossom. I'm so excited to try these out that I forgot to swatch on my hand. <laughs> they feel really nice on the lips. Very nice. So there's on the hand. In case you want to see that. This is Chance, Merveille and Blossom. So now this is Blossom. But I'm going to take them off now. And I'm going to put on 132 Vivacity. Hmm. My lips feel really soft and I have dry skin. So let's go into Vivacity. This one is like a um, toasty brown, toasty orange. Mm, this one's beautiful as well. Oh, I like this one. This one's Vivacity. Pretty. 
You gotta be careful when I think you will have to put it all the way back in because you might hit the top, maybe. Maybe not. It's really close, but not that close, but still be very, very careful because it is pretty close. And then finally, we have number, number one, 138 Vitalité. But let me take Vivacity off first. This one's gorgeous. This is the red, red. And this is on the hand, what it looks like. Again, this is Chance, Merveille, Blossom, Vitality, and Vitalité. They're both similar names. This one I love as well. It is such a beautiful, perfect red. I like it. I love them all. They're so beautiful. I'm going to let it dry for a few minutes to see if the glow dissipates and what pigment stays on. So hang on tight. I'll be back in a couple of minutes. So yeah, I've been like two minutes. It's true that the glow is not there as much, but it's still really nice. I want to know what you guys think right now. I love all of them, but I want to know your opinion. Which one's your favorite one? If you were had a chance to buy one for yourself, let me know which shade you got. Very curious to know. Any questions or comments, please leave them down below. And I'm going to leave the links of all these lipsticks plus the foundation that I'm wearing on today. I'm going to leave all the links down below in the description box for you. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Consider to subscribing to my channel if you haven't done so already. And click on the bell to get notified of future videos. I want to thank you so, so much for coming. And I want to wish you a wonderful, wonderful day. Till next time. Bye.